I'm Jonathan McRoy and I'm a uh, section chief with the United States Air Force. My passions are to, to grow professionally. Um, I'm passionate about service, uh, team building, collaboration, networking. My hopes for young professionals in the city of Wichita is that they don't leave, <laughs> but um, that they you know, start to uh, get outside of their comfort zone and uh, be willing to be comfortable with being uncomfortable. Um, you know, sometimes certain cities have their cliques or, you know, your, your, your friend circle. But, you know, I, I challenge young professionals to, to get outside of their, their friend circles and uh, make new connections, make new friends, uh, have new experiences. In the next five years, I'd like Wichita to be a regional leader, one that harnesses the collective power of, of its diversity. We're fortunate to have a lot of transient residents uh, from other states, bigger cities, um, different cultural backgrounds, and I think that uh, our city and county leadership can really benefit uh, from their ideas. And so, uh, in the next five years, I'd want to see us uh, lead change and you know benchmark processes that uh, can be uh, emulated uh, in other cities, um, so that other cities can look at Wichita and say, you know, hey, we need to do what Wichita is doing. And so I think this helps us to be competitive long term. As far as the city's transformation goes, young professionals uh, play a, a very important role. Um, I think that it's important um, young professionals guard against cynicism and really seek to get involved uh, not only uh, civically but socially. Um, I think that uh, young professionals need to be leaders within their communities um, in any way necessary, whether that be nonprofit to uh, city to county. Um, I think uh, civic engagement is going to be crucial and uh, their involvement is really going to be what uh, helps Wichita uh, bust through as a, as a regional leader. I believe my, my service to the nation and to the city as a member of the United States Air Force is, is pretty impactful. Um, but not only that, I think that um, as veterans we're challenged to um, not only serve uh, as, as men and women of the armed forces, but to serve in our communities as well. And so to that end, uh, I'm a member of my dad board in District 4, where I work with my city councilman to uh, help make our district better, uh, to ensure that the voices of our citizens are, are heard and addressed. And so uh, these are some of the ways that I'm involved. Get outside of your comfort zone. Um, be comfortable with being uncomfortable. Um, be willing to have tough conversations, but approach challenges with a growth mindset. Um, you know, take the time to reflect back on challenges and, you know, perform that deep introspection and ask yourself, you know, from a, from a challenging experience, did I learn any new skills, develop any new talents? Uh, develop a new way of problem solving or looking at problems. I think that this is good advice um, to grow uh, as from a leader perspective as well as um, just a, an overall professional in any facet.